Hey YouTube, it's Audrey and I'm here to sh share with you our April friendship swap and the friendship swap is between me, Scrap the World, who's Tamika, Shantae, who's Shantana H, and Cheryl, who's Jim Zyle here on YouTube. We decided we would try doing a monthly swap to kind of keep our mojo going in slower times when we didn't have other projects and then also um, to push ourselves creatively and to challenge ourselves to try something new and different. So, this month was my month to choose and I definitely pushed us all because none of us had ever made what um, I came up with for us to chat to try. Um, so, I'll start with just the card because one of the elements was that we were supposed to make a card that we could use to give to someone else. So that's what you're looking at now um, are the cards that I made them. The card had to be a card with some kind of a straight cut in it. So it had to have um, like this one has a straight cut. So it could be a step card or a trifold shutter card or something as long as it had um, straight cuts. So this is a card. I did a center um, step card and I um, added a stamp set that's from Hot Off the Press and it says you're not old, you're 25 plus shipping and handling. And I think all of us that order stuff online <laughs> kind of see the, see, we see the humor in that. So um, this could be a birthday card. Um, or just to cheer somebody up card. I didn't use um, a sentiment on the inside so I just let that um, be blank for them so that they could use whatever sentiment they would like to or just write a note in there. So that is the card and I packaged them all up in um, clear bags to keep them protected. And then I also made a little card for them um, that's just from this cute little domino paper. It's just a simple little card. Um, don't think I'm going to decorate it at all. Just write them a note. And then I made envelopes for all of those. And the reason for using the domino paper for the card is because our challenge decides to card was to make three sets of domino books for each person so that's a total of nine books um, I had given them a choice of six themes we had um, steampunk shabby chic beautiful black women sewing inspirational and Paris Bling. So, you could pick any of those, but you had to pick three of those and make three of those and make three different themed um, sets for each. If I explain that correctly. Anyway, so we will start off with my sewing ones. These are the ones that I created for the sewing theme. And they turned out so doggone cute. Yes, they did. So, here is my sewing one. And hopefully you are seeing this. Try and move the light a little bit. But I have a um, little stick or pin cushion embellishment and then I just cut a circle and matted the domino with that oval not a circle oval and then for the feet I had little bitty spools so I wrapped them in twine and glued them on the bottom then all around each domino side, there are many teeny tiny tiny buttons. And then 
the thread or the ribbon that's holding them together is some of that ruler ribbon that came from Michaels. And then I just put some um, ribbon end caps on them because it otherwise would ravel. So I have this one tied towards the back. And then um, I have a little sticker piece that's needle and thread. But it opens up like that. And then I have stamps and um, sticker cutouts, die cuts. So the first one I stamp Sewing Men's the Soul. And then there's a spool. There's a dress form paper. This is a little um, button puffy sticker. There's a woman with an old fashioned sewing machine, scissors, another button, so happy, and um, another spool of thread. And on the other side, there are more buttons to dress form paper, scissors, and then spool and two different dress forms that I stamped. And then on the pieces that I left out of the um, without matting, like I matted those without, the pieces without mat have gold stickers along the top and the bottom. So I just think that one turned out really really cute I like all the ones and you'll see my other two and I'll try not to make this video too too long but I want to show them to you and, ah, I just dropped one okay we'll find that later <laughs> we'll keep moving on my second one is inspirational and it is done in peaches and blues. Once you'll see blues once you open it up. But um, I just added some a resin flower and two other flowers here. I did pink pearls around the side. And with this one. I just tied ribbon around it. I didn't attach the ribbon. But this one opens horizontally. Hard to get that all in frame that way. So I wanted to do something different. This is inspirational and it has different um, sayings. And all my sayings were horizontal. So I thought, well, okay, we just need to make the book a different orientation. So, I got one that says, let your faith be bigger than your fear. Miracles happen. There's butterflies and flowers in the center. The word hope. And don't tell God how big your problems are. Tell your problems how big God is. Then the back is just plain. Then on the other side, there's peace. Faith, consistent believing when it's beyond the power of reason to believe love and then faith is a knowledge within the heart beyond the reach of proof and then I'm not sure who said that I can't really read that this tiny but anyway that is the second one and I won't take the time to tie that back up I'll just kind of leave it there and then last but not least is of course you know I had to choose Paris Bling. So I have one. Now this one is the only one that's slightly different. They have different sets of pictures in each. Um, I had purchased some domino collages for Paris and then that's why they're they're different sets so I'll show you one but what I did um, was on this one I put one of the pictures on the domino and then I covered it with this glass dome that I had gotten um, from I think it's craft fancy at the scrapbook expo so again with this one 
I did not attach the ribbon. I just tied the ribbon on there. And this one is a shoe. And it says Paris there. And then I have bling all the way around. And then I also have mesh bling all over the back. So with this one, we open it up. And we have different pair, different Paris pictures and themes. There's the Eiffel Tower. There's a dress form. The rose that says Paris. And I love heart Paris. And then a sign that says toward Paris. Paris. And I put little um, silver dazzle stickers on the opposite ones. Every other one. Then turn it over and I added some stamps from um, Close to My Heart. This is a Close to My Heart set. And I cut off the legs because the legs aren't on there, but of course, this isn't wide enough. So then just the word fashionista and then more of those stickers. And of course, you knew this is my favorite one. So I won't open up each, but when the ladies get theirs and do their videos, then you can see those. Um, so that's what our April challenge was. And it was a challenge. As I said, I came up with it and whew, it gave me fits. And I think it gave the other lady fits too. Um, not so much that it was hard. Just coming up with some, you know, the tiny embellishments and the tiny pictures and everything so um anyway check out their channels i will have all of their information below and well, i'll just put that back here and thank you for watching and let me know what you think about our domino books um i'm just going to package them up in um I think parchment bags and um, use a doily to package them. But anyway, thank you for watching and you have a great and very, very blessed day. Bye-bye.